hello guys welcome back to today's video in this video we are going to be solving the problem of authorization failed in this video let's say you are trying to log into your your broker's account and you are seeing authorization failed in this video we will be sorting this out so let's assume that this is your account and and these are your details and everything you feel they are correct and you click on login and you are seeing authorization failed like this okay this is what you are going to do do not panic this is what you are going to do it's very simple guys now let me log let me delete this my account currently let me delete this one i logged in let me just delete it so that ooh. okay so let me just delete this where is the accounts now what you have to do is instead of you to be looking for where to copy just go direct and log into your application website so you log into your if it's xnest that you're using you log into their site okay you log into your xnest account so now once you once you're logged in once you're logged into your broker's account you are going to see an option where you will instead of you to copy Okay, this is my XNES account. I'm waiting for it to load. So this is my XNES account. This time around, I'm not using the application, so I'm using the website. That's how to solve it. Make sure you use the website. So on the website, I'm going to see this trade that is here. This trade here, guys. Here, this yellow place. You click on it. Now it says download and install mt5 platform so uh, this one says trade directly from your browser this is not what i'm looking for this about my mt5 account so i'll click on this mt5 this time around i'm going to present with these options instead of me to copy these details the way we normally copy them i will rather click on this open terminal this mt5 open terminal so if i click here i will not need to copy all these ones i will only need to enter my password so i'll copy it and here we have it so i'll have to enter my password here so let me pause the video to enter my password so now i've entered my password i will click on this save password so that i will not have to always enter my password or log in anytime i want to switch to my xnest account so here i'll click on sign in let's see what we have to this sign in? yes we signed it correctly guys so now i solve the problem of authorization failed so this can be applicable if you're using deriv broker as well so let me try logging in with my deriv broker as well so for those of you that are using deriv this is how you also do it so once you log into your deriv accounts on your browser guys remember i said browser not your application this time around you come over to this place that has cfds and click on it once you click on it you are going to see this open that is here okay this is open here i'll click on this open and once you click on this open the first part Part you're going to see is this option to copy these things so i don't need to copy these things i will rather scroll down to this trade with mt5 mobile app okay if you're using the web you click on it but i'm using the mobile app so i'll click on the mobile app here i will not need to enter those server and the login everything every other thing has been entered automatically so i will only need to enter my password here So right now i've entered my password what next is for me to save my password and click on sign in so let me see what will happen as you can see i've logged in correctly and there was no authorization failed so as simple as that that's how you solve authorization failed issues involving your broker and your metatrader 5. now if you have any question let me know in the comment section and if you tried it and it did work also let me know in the comment section if you have not started using the reef i will also advise you to check it out the reef offers different advantages they have good um customer support and they have synthetic indices boom and crash and the rest okay the reef is very good as well you can try it and if you want to check out xnest i will also put the link in the description of this video please try try them out and let me know and the last but not the least
please subscribe to the channel so that we we'll meet in my subsequent videos and if you have any question or comment let me know in the comment section you're welcome see you in my next one